Okay, onwards and upwards. So, get my trusty shave down credit card, which we use for prying, and see how we get this board out. Is it a matter of lifting it, or does it need to be coerced, at, coerced into coming out? Oh no, it lifts straight out, there we go. Lifts straight out. So, you'll see here, oh there we go, there's a, base, there's a shell inside. You'll see here, they have seen, they appear to, comparing to the, but comparing my findings to the other guy's video on YouTube, they seem to have, have adopted an aluminium plate arrangement here, which is held in place by eight screws. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And um, I presume that's for heat sinking. Not sure. It's a very nice piece of aluminium, that is. That looks very well made. Um, am I going to take this off and look underneath? I don't know. Probably will. <laughs> I can't resist taking taking things apart. I probably will. There's your USB 2.0 socket just there. You can see that. I can see it better if I hold it up to the camera actually. USB 2. And where we're going to focus today? We're having a day off. What's going on? There we go. That's USB 2 because there's no extra pins in there. Let's zoom out. Oops, too far. So yeah, that's that's basically a quick look inside the EE version, the Hub 6.0B of the uh, of the Smart Hub, which is the. If you think about it too deeply, it can get quite confusing. There's apparently there's a 6.0A version of the Smart Hub or the BT Hub, or the B, whatever they want to call it this week, <laughs> BT Smart Hub. This is the EE Smart Hub, aka the Hub 6.0B, which is how my UPnP devices um, properties list shows it in Windows Explorer. Now I want to see if I can get this. Uh, what's under this metal plate? I bet that's a heatsink. You know, I bet that's a big heatsink. In fact, it is because there's a indentation there, which implies that's been depressed. On a press in the factory to make that the other side of this indentation. Obviously, that'll be that's convex there. Sorry, concave there. On the other side, it'll be con it'll be convex where it's sticking out. So it'll be a heatsink uh, pad, not heatsink pad. That basically they've pressed this aluminium in the factory, so it pushes out the other side. So it presses against the CPU die. Anyway, that's a quick look. What a squeaky chair here. So excuse that. And uh, yeah, that's a quick look. That's my timer. Um, anything else you should know? I don't know, let's get the camera off the stand and have a gander, shall we? Have a propaganda. Oh, the puns, the puns. They keep coming, don't they?